Hey yo, it's me Harper Savage and it is day 6 of 12 days of arts and coffee. That's where we do an art or craft and we cozy up with some coffee. Today we're going to be using the watercolor pad from the Arteza advent calendar along with some of the supplies and watercolor from there. They only had two watercolors so I'm going to be adding my own palettes in as well to help me along here. But first we need to figure out what coffee we're drinking. Today is cookie jar coffee, salted caramel cookie. Now I think this is a different brand than the Brooklyn one that we've had the past couple times. So I'm excited to try it. All right, here it is. Let's go ahead and give it a try. I'd say this one's pretty good. First things first, we're gonna go ahead and squeeze some of the watercolor out onto my palette right here. Let's see what it looks like. Very like muted colors. Let's zoom it in now. Oh, I think I do really like this color. Very nice, like peachy color almost. This one I think is called Spiced Apple. Yeah, Spiced Apple. Focus. This other one is called Stone Blue. Let's give that a try. I think this color is really nice as well. I think they will go together. Like, they're not super Christmassy, even though they're red and green, but they're like muted enough that it's more like a peachy and like a, a bluish green. Let's see how they blend together. Didn't quite clean my brush just then. They make a brownish color. So it's not like something I feel like I could make one art with only these colors. So I will be adding my own watercolors in as we go along but still very nice colors also for the watercolor paper itself um i typically use mixed media paper because i like smoother finishes but i think it's all right i don't know I'm, i guess i'm just not the best judge of watercolor paper because i've only ever used hansen oh my god that was really hard to rip out of there i think i'm gonna do like a leaf I think it's looking cute so far. I really was just trying to smooth out how like dark it was out here and kind of spread it out without making it like super duper smooth because I do like the texture of watercolor. I'm gonna wait for this to dry and then I'm gonna 
see about using some of the liner pens that came with the advent calendar. All right, I'm gonna try out this liner here. I think the, the liner is all right. I think it could be a little bit darker. Um, it could also be because maybe this isn't 100% dry, even though it is dry to the touch. I don't know. I won't really know how this liner is until I work on one of my more typical projects. If that's that one, do another. I just noticed that the, the bluish color we have here is not that far off from my background. So maybe we could do something like with the white pen. It's like a watercolor background texture. Try time now. I waited a little bit longer this time before I started to do some line work on top. I'm feeling really inspired by the background. So I think I want to do maybe like a moon and some clouds with like snowflakes. Coming down. If this pen will work the way I want it to, it kind of seems like it's not. The show must go on. The pen is not the greatest. Um, I'm sure the jelly roll would have re reacted in the same manner though. Uh, I think Posca probably would have been better to use here. So it's like an average white pen. You're gonna have the same problems that you do with all of them. But moving on. I did a nice uh, red version, like how I just did a blue version. We're gonna draw something else over top of it once it's all dry. All right, for this one, I've decided I'm gonna be doing a poinsettia and I'm gonna do it freehand in the gold marker. I already put it off center. Add some more dots this way, maybe it'll help. And here we go. I think that looks pretty cute. Not my best poinsettia ever, but it's not the worst. All right, next. All right, I'm gonna trace out kind of what I want for this one.
give the pen another shot and I'm still not impressed by it. Well, my coffee's all gone, so I think we're done for today. Go ahead and flip through what we got done. We did a leaf. We tried to do like a night sky type of deal with snow. Poinsettia. And some icicles. I can't really pick which one's my favorite. I feel like they're all like mid-tier uh, for what I usually do. I really like the colors on this page, but I don't like the art, like the illustration I tried to do. I like the poinsettia. Uh, maybe the icicles? I don't know. Let me know what your favorite is in the comments below. That's gonna be it from me today. If you want to check out another cool video, you can go ahead and tap the video here. And if you want to catch up on anything you missed, you can go ahead and tap the video here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to do all the cool YouTube-y things. So comment, liking, and subscribing. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!